Hey. Oh, good morning. Oh, I've literally forgot that I had my mask on. I feel like whenever I get out of an Uber, I'm just like conditioned into wearing the mask. And then I just carry on wearing it because it's nice and warm. Like I feel warmer when I'm wearing a mask. Anyway, good morning everyone. Welcome to the first day of Vlogmas. I don't really know what this is going to be because I'm saying I'm going to do Vlogmas because I have two exciting days coming up. And then the rest of December, I've not really got anything planned. And then obviously towards Christmas, then I have things planned again. So we're going to very lightly say welcome to Vlogmas day one. But I don't really know what this is going to be or if it's even going to be a thing but I'm actually heading down to London for the next two days. I've literally just got back from London. I've just got back. Like, well not just. I've just got back from Lewis's house. I got back from London two days ago. Um, I'm going to open my blinds and we'll continue this chat because I'm making no sense. I'm talking shit. Good morning everyone. Welcome back to my vlog channel. Now I haven't really vlogged much over the past few months. I feel like I've posted like two vlogs and now I'm going to try and do vlogmas. I mean I don't really know how this is going to go. Like I said I'm in London for the next two days. I've got a few Christmassy things happening. It's going to be fun, fresh and wonderful and Christmassy and I'm really excited. However for like the middle part of December I don't really have anything going off and then I go to Edinburgh and like I'll vlog that obviously but like for the most part I don't really have any plans but I did vlog most a few years ago when I was literally living in uni living in uni living in London at uni full-time pretty much working full-time at Urban Outfitters because it was December and it's the busiest time of the month busiest time of the month busiest time of the year still somehow managed to vlog every single day so I've done it before I know I can do it I had a less exciting life then I also had so much more going on then that meant I couldn't vlog so realistically I have no excuse so Byron if you are getting to day three and deciding that you actually aren't doing anything with your day apart from sitting in all day then bitch remember that you used to do it and you did it and here i am this is this vlog was day one Woo! Woo! This this coming down Christmas. Christmas. Oh, I'm gonna watch the last season. Baby, please come home. Girls, so Freya just pops in on her way past. She's actually gonna spec save us, my loves. I'm um, getting some glasses, my loves. And I, I'm gonna pack my suitcase. This is the current situation with my suitcase. So this is the suitcase that I am, in fact, wanting to take. This is the suitcase that I took last time. With all my stuff exploding everywhere. So I need to, I, I literally need like three outfits. Two Christmas outfits and an outfit for tomorrow daytime and I'm just going to travel in one. But the thing is that suitcase only fits like one pair of shoes in. How am I going to know what shoes I want to wear? You want to have a pair of shoes for three days? Queen shirt. <laughs> I'm so close yet so far. <laughs> Right everyone, after much struggle, I am now finally ready to go. I've literally just got on the coziest outfit ever. I'm absolutely sweating. I have like 19 layers on, but um, when I get to London, I can't check into my hotel, so I don't want to be wandering around in the cold. Got some little boots on, my case is all packed, I've got my backpack and my bag, and I'm ready to rock and roll. Let's go to London, baby. <laughs> in London. My hotel room is incredible. I'll give you a little hotel room tour in a second. I'm absolutely boiling. I had my jacket on, this cardigan on, I have this jumper on top, and then I have a t-shirt and a vest, and I am sweating like crazy. This hotel is literally beautiful, and as I walked in, my friend Hamza works on the door. Like, I literally worked with him at Urban Outfitters, not seen him since I lived in London. I have literal sweat patches on my best and he were working here he works here so it's gonna be really nice i get to see my friend hamza i get to see everyone here oh my god this is glass anna's on her way we were meant to travel down together oh you can see me while i'm showering bitch this is so beautiful i'm gonna give you a little room so i'm way overly excited i'm gonna show you the room and then yeah i don't know what i'm gonna do anna doesn't get here for like three hours so i think i'm gonna call flossie and her to see where they're at i literally cannot believe this hotel i went upstairs and all the front of the hotel's glass and it just looks out the most incredible view wow wow we were 
Um, I haven't even said why I'm here, have I? I can't remember if I've even said why I'm here, but I'm here for my management's Christmas dinner slash party. Which is not until this evening, it starts at 7, so Anna gets here around 6, then the actual function. The event starts at 7, my dear. Right, so you're gonna have to excuse all my stuff everywhere, but when you walk in, this is the bathroom. I'm loving the bits of wood everywhere, it's called the treehouse is where I'm staying. Um, ignore the sweat patch on my little vest, it's called the treehouse, but it is actually beautiful. Like I said, the reception and everything is incredible. There's a little coffee shop downstairs, I'm loving this bathroom, everything so cute and so nice. We've got a little Paddington bear. Oh, look at that. Please look after this bear. Thank you. That is the cutest thing. Also could potentially watch me whilst I sleep. Then this is the bedroom. These pillars were all from Urban Outfitters as well, which is really fun. Love that. I know that. The little desk area, TV. This is my favourite part about it all. These like little reading nooks. Like I would absolutely love a house with a window that sits onto a view like this. Like literally the sun's just set. The London Eye's over there. You can see the rides going around at Winter Wonderland and then literally down here here is like Oxford Circus like you walk along there and you're straight into Oxford Circus so it's a literally an incredible location I've got such a good side to the building for the view I just want to sit in one of these little nooks and read I don't know what what to do with myself oh my god a lucky eight ball what do you ask an eight ball and me and Lewis going to be together forever it is decidedly so don't believe me Queen Lewis if you ever try and dump me I'm, I'm gonna play this clip and be like the fortune said no what else can I ask is tonight gonna be a good night Outlook good. Hmm. Am I gonna be rich? Reply hazy, try again. Queen, don't wanna try again, ruined my day. Thank you very much. Ooh, I feel like I'm staying in someone's like apartment. Like this feels like these things that I can explore. Oh my God, there's some chocolates. Is this from my management? Is this mine? Is this mine? If I eat this, will I get in trouble? It's a hotel chocolate. Hotel chocolate. Um, advent calendar. Is this mine? Or if I eat it, will I have to pay for it? Maybe this is a gift. I don't know if this is from my management team or if this is from the hotel. But either way, it's cute and I like it. I'm gonna fucking eat it. I'm gonna eat it, batch. I'm literally gonna find out where everyone is, what everyone's doing. There's a bunch of people from my management here as well, so I'm gonna see. I don't even know who the hell's on my management. I know it's me and Anna and Saf, but I'm not seeing Saf until tomorrow because she's not coming to the actual Christmas thing. I don't know who else is bloody on the management. Also, ignore the fact that I have a hickey. Okay, I'm seven. Me and my boyfriend love to give each other hickeys. I'm kidding, we don't actually, but like, just... Excuse that, my loves. I hate to brag, I really, really do, but less than half an hour later, and I have plans, so I'm putting my shoes back on, and I'm going out. Right, I'm all dressed and ready again. I'm literally just wearing the same as I wore earlier, but I feel like I didn't really show you my outfit. I really like it. I never really wear jeans this color. I always try and wear like, the lightest wash jeans I can, but I've got all my layers back on. Got a lovely little knit from All Saints. Then this is from ASOS. Got a lovely little weekdays t-shirt on, my bag that I literally wear every single day. I've got this Carhartt jacket on. These jeans are from Obey, and then I've got my little white boots on. I wish you could see the full outfit, because I really, really like it. However, I'm now gonna head to Flossies. I'm hungry. But I don't have to wait out until I had that sushi and stuff on the train, but I don't have to wait out until oh my god What is that? Oh my god, there's a little bird in there. What the hell? How do I get it to come out? Hi, I Don't have to hold out because I want to be hungry for like I want it to be like a big meal But then I also don't want to have drinks beforehand and be like because I've literally just not eaten all day. Anyway, I'm gonna go to Flossies. I'm gonna stop rambling on. Have a little walk up Oxford Street in the dark with all the lights on. It's gonna be really cute. So let's bloody go. Oh, it's Christmas time. I feel sad I can't help it. Got you on my mind. Don't be shy. Don't be shy. Show me the tag. Still from Sarah. <laughs> Right everyone, I'm at Four States, as you can see. We're just watching a bit of Humble YouTube. Humble Tube. Ready? Wait. Vlogmas. Oh, what did they come to? They're from I Bershka. Yeah, I thought so. I wanted to say no. Oh! Why did I think you were, like, doing something really weird? That scared me. I can't believe Haz is back with our friend again. Do you know what? It's been a crazy... Crazy 10 months. It's been a crazy 10 months about it. So you call my first vlog, must vlog confronting my ex best friend. Yeah. You're gonna look so nice, and I'm gonna actually look like. No, it's just easy, it's fucking easy. It's like oh, dress tight. Queen. I'm just having the sudden realization that I am actually having full Christmas dinner. Never mind. <laughs> well, I'm just thinking, like, is it, like, it's Christmas dinner. Where are you, um, going for it? The hotel. Oh, is it the Oh, it's like... Yeah. Is it at the Ned? No, it's at the tree house. Do you think it's going to be Christmas dinner? Well, at Turkey's? Yeah. 
so that's what we had that other year. I'm bloody confused, but that was lunch. It's 7pm, babe. I'm going to have a champagne. I want something light. I've just had a full pack of Oreos, guys. Joe and I said I weren't going to eat before my meal tonight. I, in fact, had some mango, a pack of Skittles, and these Oreos. What is this pack? And now I'm not hungry and now I just want a little champagne. Right, Anna's come to my room. We're now dressed in red. I feel like I look weird, like something feels off. I don't know if it's because I'm trying to grow my hair out at the sides. So it just looks concerning, my love. So... So I like an air hostess, so... Do you think we're going to have Christmas dinner? I can't... No, we're not at our house. Oh. We've got chips. Oh, what the fuck? Um, oh, I wanted gravy. Never mind, right. Christmas dinner. Let's go for dinner. I've decided we're retiring the night here. I honestly don't know where we've just been. Like, I'm very confused. I don't know where we've just been. Flossie sorted us out for the night. I kept saying all night, do we have to pay for these drinks? Apparently we didn't have to oh pay for God, anything. The woman said to me it was twenty pound entry on the way in, but then never charged us. Yeah, same. I went over to pay her, and then she just went. Yeah, I don't. I don't know why we've just been. Me and Anna kept saying we feel like we were in GTA. Like, do you know, on GTA, I say it's real when you go into like a strip club. That it, we weren't in a strip club, but that is what it felt like. Very odd. The music got good halfway through, so then I was like, all right, fine. The music's good. I'll exist here and then as we were leaving i thought two girls were viewers they came over to me like oh where have you been all night and i thought oh they just were like viewers so I was like, I've, I've been dancing bitch and they were like same and they were like you're gonna come home with us and i was like what and then i clocked that they were the dancers like in the leotard like dancing on the stage and they were trying to get me to go home with them me and Anna are just taking off our makeup like two girls would and um, I have blisters and we've got to be up in the morning. So welcome to day one of Vlogmas. I have nothing else planned for the rest of this month apart from Olivia's motel party tomorrow and Edinburgh. So don't look forward to anything else. But enjoy Vlogmas day one everyone. I hope you enjoyed it. I love you a lot and I will see you hopefully tomorrow. Maybe not. Who knows? We've got to get up for breakfast. I'm starving and I'm drunk. Bye. Oh, I would love a McDonald's. That festive burger, I could fucking love Ah, oh, bye, Queens. There's a McDonald's right around the corner. What, could we have walked to it? Yeah, like, it's literally around oh, the corner. Okay. I used to go, the, my uni is across the road. Is it open? Um, maybe. Maybe we get a McDonald's, maybe we not. I'm very tired. Some girls tried to sex me, and now I'm going to sleep. Bye. Vlogmas day one. My socks are off. Night. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas.